all right so this is your experiment number 1 design of integrator as per your syllabus so the requirement is that the input frequency should be between 300 hertz to 20 kilohertz input voltage 2 volts peak to 6.5 volts peak it means 2 volts peak to peak and uh, plus 2 volts peak and minus 2 volts peak so plus minus 12 volts peak to peak 4 volts peak to peak in fact and 13 volts peak to peak here in this case uh, now we have already I have already given you the design steps for integrator uh, if you want to, you can refer back to the notes which I have already given you long back um, the same steps I have used and I have designed this uh, integrator let us see the output now your input is one end that is 2 volts peak to peak and 300 hertz so this is your uh, signal which is a square wave and integration of the square wave should result into a triangular waveform so let us see what we are getting here so you actually get the green trace is the output so you will be getting the integrated output for this uh, circuit uh, so this is how you can design an integrator and test it at your end now as a part of practical you are supposed to design this on your own and uh, at the same time uh, build a circuit in using multisim and uh, you know trace the outputs on uh, your whatever file papers whatever it is that should uh, be your uh, practical session uh, you also have to integ uh, you have also have to find out the frequency response we already know how to find out the frequency response so here in AC sweep you have to go for the AC uh, response uh, AC sweep you have to go for the frequency response we are not interested in the phase so this can be decibels so you can see here that from this point to this point it, will, it should work as an integrator ok this is what we have already discussed in the class so this part of the waveform, this part of the uh, frequency response tells you that it is actually going to work as an integrator. Let us see the other extreme, whether I get similar results. Of course, uh, AC response will not change here. So I just change back it to interactor. So again you can see that the output still is uh, a square wave, uh, is, a, is a triangular waveform and this is how it really works as um, an integrator. But wait, this is designed for, uh, rather put up for 2 kilohertz, if you go for 20 kilohertz, there will be some degradation but still then you have you can recognize that this is actually giving me some kind of integration over here this is the extreme point so uh, these waveforms you will have to plot and carry out your practical uh, experimentation with this circuit